honestly, it's like Jay Z and Kanye. Come on, man! Don't I think. think no, yeah, I, I think yeah. that Tarantino to me is like a Kanye. The way he creates. I, like, I really like the way Kanye does videos. I really like. You know the very. It's just like proactive, yeah. but like Jay Z seems like he's more calculated. Do you know what I mean? And more some some guy evaluates. He said that like, watch the throne. Yeah. He said but the reason that like, Ham and those other songs came out was because Kanye wanted to put them out. Jay wanted to hold them and give Watch the Throne. And that's why those bonus tracks on the album are not part of the album. Kanye wanted to. That's very similar to, you know... You know but I kind of identify with that because I'm kind of like... Just like when I get excited about something, I want to throw it out. Mm. Do you know what I mean? And mm-hmm. I'm kind of just, just pick up the pieces later. Yeah. Whereas I think D, I think D's more... I think it's just a person. I don't, know, I don't know if it's a star sign thing or what, but like D's more calculated. Sensible songs, you know what I mean? But it's yeah, like, well, it's Kanye is Kanye is a, is a Gemini as well. Mm. Um, I don't know, Jay. Do you resonate with Jay as well? December. Yeah, Jay. I resonate more with Kanye. In um, that, Jay, in that Jay, sense. Jay is more of a. I think you resonate more with Jay. To be honest, to be honest, like you have the embodiment of Jay. Every time I hear you, mm. it's like I get the Jay feel from you. But like I'm like that's why I'm like. Yeah. I don't mean musically. I mean just like personality-wise. Personality-wise, and just like no. But even in that, in, even in that regard, I think you're a bit more technical, though. You're a bit more technical because you can produce as well. Mm. But that's why, if you were to just exercise, you know, the art of rap, and you embody that, yeah. I mean, you you will shine, and it will be it will be like a J situation mm. when it's in control. You're in control of that situation. You know, I'm one hundred percent. Yeah, one hundred percent. Yeah. And Kanye, you can play Kanye. You can play Kanye as well. Like, so I mean, yeah. but. You know what I mean? But I mean, Jay, he's got the same star sign as Jay, right? I don't know. He's December 4th. I don't know. Yeah, December 4th. I don't know about the star sign. You know what it is? Some of it applies. Some of it applies. Two back from Kendrick, yeah. They were born like one day apart from each other. I mean, as in, you know, dates, birthday. Yeah. But. No, Kanye was like on the seventh of mm. June. I'm the sixth of June. Mm. So I mean, I think there's some, there's some. My brother's on the third, and I yeah. see a lot of, a lot of things that I used to do in him. I think there's some validity to it, man. There is, but the arg- the kind of argument's gonna be the fact that it's from years and years and years ago, and it's like. I've gone some years, years ago, and people, uh, humans have adapted and evolved. Yeah. Like, to base you, how you are, on something that's, like, years ago, it's a bit like... And I think especially when you're on the conscious path, because, yeah. like, these are inanimate objects, planets. Yeah. And stars, you know what you I mean? You don't, you don't like, want something to label, but like, yeah, you're like this, you're like that, you're like that, and then that, 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 when you, you can see, like... It's like, should a rock determine how a human being Really is? and truly, you can see, you, you can see, um like, an Aquarius um, horoscope, and you could, like, a... Uh, Cancer could probably resonate with that's, some that's, that's exactly what I'm saying. It's yeah. weird. It's kind of like this. It's like if you grew up in a rough, like neighborhood, you, know, <coughs> you you could like turn out really good. If you have like a really good upbringing, you could turn out. If you have a good um, family. Good upbringing, you can turn out to be a cracker. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's like there's like, no like. You could you could you could have been gone. You could have been spoon fed throughout your whole life and existence. And you could have been going to all private schools mm. and you have the best form of education and schooling of, of every sort, but yeah. eventually still turn up a mess up, yeah. as opposed to someone that has been from concrete, yeah. you know, in from from yeah. proper tarmac yeah. and grown from that and become gold. Yeah, you know what I mean, so I think, I I think we're, we're too complex human beings. Yeah, I think when you look every at animals, human being, you look at animals and plants, you can measure their activity based off patterns mm-hmm. to a degree becomes more complicated more I'm intelligent than the, the being is but when you come to human beings to, to this day you can't people are still struggling to that like, label like humans like oh like this this type this that type because humans people have so many layers to them it's, it's hard mm. like you like even people who like scientists know that they've tried but like when they're like oh this people some people like this way that way that way like us as humans we tend to we just end up proving them wrong because that person yeah. who you said, for example, was like the most like shyest, quietest person, end up doing like something really crazy. But that yeah. person who's like, because he's all like, loud and bashy, he's supposed to have like no those particular emotions. Then wait a second, he did that sort of thing. But I so, do like, believe, as opposed to that, I do believe that your surroundings can really mold you. 
Oh yeah, absolutely. Can. Every single thing. Can. No, it is one hundred percent influence. Yeah. Influence. Absolutely. Because you understand as like a baby, like we can see ourselves as infants in the eyes of the universe yeah, yeah, as human yeah. beings. Yeah. Full stop. Like trying to understand what really is in the energy. Yeah. You're the talking about mold and the con, the con. No, but wait, the content. It can get deep. Brain. It can get. It can get. Yeah, exactly. As a, as a, as a, as a. I get that. As an intellect, yeah. just existing, because your yeah, brain like, functions well, in ways is, but man, that yeah, is complex. The Kugel, that when you're on the conscious path, intellect isn't that important. It's like you go beyond anything that you could have ever experienced. Fair enough, but that. what causes, what influences that level of wanting to transpire to be something of that yeah. nature? This is what I want to say. I feel like, so I'm not going to put pinpoint it to one thing but I think it's if, a collection of if things. life hasn't been 100% the way you wanted it to be then you look for alternative things I think if you've had life just how you you may not look in that direction because, I agree, I agree. you know what I mean yeah, I agree. fair you enough fair enough um, hard times I think why do you think like no look, 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 Mike, before, no before, way before you go there Mike yeah, no way some of the best music was done in the 70s Jaden Smith look, listen Jaden Smith Mike, Jaden Smith Mike, let, me, let, me, let me just say this yeah. I hate you, I hate you. Like, Marvin Gaye Stevie Wonder like just black people that struggled in the 70s yeah they had to go inward it was hard to times. create you know, you know, you know, you know how close spiritual you know, know what I mean it's you know like, how close Motown is to um, Martin Luther King and like, all oh all man but I'm so saying when you hear when you listen to a musician that hadn't really experienced in that time that she's had like no disrespect, but like Elvis, you don't feel the same way. That pain, I know you don't mean. feel that. And but, that, but that same pain and like something that you hear in that it's song. It's kind of different. Never, Elvis still had a hustle to him. You're never going to hear that. Never gonna I'm hear talking again. about that deeper element. The deeper element that you draw from. Fair enough. Um, Jaden Smith still has the level of. He, you could say that he's been given everything that pretty much handed to him because of his, his dad, but he still has the need to kind of understand the universe from his point of view and understand it more yeah. so you, you find him saying some things that are kind of yo you've yeah. been meditating too much like, yeah, I'm, I'm not saying this, this is the, the concrete this is what I'm not saying like um, having it hard equates to you wanting to be spiritual I'm saying it seems like more people like that that have those kind of journeys tend to tend to go to that side more it just seems that way you know what I mean like I'm, it's not every single human being on Bro. the planet Fair enough. I mean, yeah, right. when you want something, that's that could lead to you finding, trying to find a solution. You know, it's like Max. I'll tell you this, yeah. Even just experience of living in West, girl, people play games. Like, cause a lot of people there have it good. They're not thinking deep about anything. They're not having no deep. What type it's of games on the surface? I'm saying it's just surface games. Like, oh, nice bag, Louis Vuitton. Ooh, you know what I mean? And this is like a serious conversation they're having. Daily conversations they're having is on the surface. So when you're coming from poorer backgrounds, you're struggling, bro. So you're like when you when you speak to man, you're looking at you're seeing his struggle in your struggle. Yeah, I hear so you know what I mean? It's yeah. like that's not every single person in the world, but I'm saying you look at communities of people and like that's why look, some of the best art comes from the worst places. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? There's mm-hmm. reasons for these things. Some of the some some of the most that like, for example. Some of the most that like, mess like I don't want to say messed up, but some people have like really had like difficult like lives and that sort of thing. Like Adele, and made the best music. I can yeah. tell Adele's been through a lot of depression, man. Just mm. through her music, because every like men, every album, men, men every album is about heartbreak. Yeah, and it's not even just depression though. It's like having when you when like you don't have many choices. Like if you're born into like certain things, you have choices. But when you're like given limited options and you feel like you're you stuck. have to check yourself yeah, I don't know about that man I don't know about that people go through fame you, is, you think fame's an easy thing to deal with on a, on, a, on a major scale like that stuff that Justin Bieber's gone through all those Hollywood stars imagine bringing yeah. a child into that stuff and they have yeah. to witness it from upbringing that they yeah. can't have spend time with their parents at early age look at Michael yeah. Michael's like one perfect example of someone that Missed out on his childhood and that affected him in his later years. Yeah, actually, yeah. You know really, I mean, really, didn't get the things that were not really as substantial and needed, necessary, or thought to have not been necessary. But later on, it kind of counted because he's making Neverland. He's doing all these things with kids and it kind of, like, I don't believe that he touched those kids, but I believe that his childhood, he missed out and he's trying to... Yeah, he was just trying to recreate trying to it. Yeah, recreate it, recreate it, man. And I mean, it was too friendly and it came across crazy P- and he P- was a mill ticket as well P- on top P- of it exactly P- P- his, his advice used to say to me like I understand that you know you haven't had a child but you need to watch out because 
one of those parents of those kids are going to see that you're you are easily taken advantage of and they're going to take like you exactly. you and that's what happened and apparently happened. those phone calls are saying that i think the dad of the truth that was molested apparently was saying that we're gonna make sure that this dude this dude never sells a record again or I something think I they wanted to well. take him down they wanted to brutalize they wanted to they they, to when people see that you're vulnerable and they can take you, like they, they like they'll do it. And that's they'll what, find a way. They'll yeah. find a way, especially the how you get. This is the, the thing. This is how life is. Unfortunately, the how you that's get. How like, are, the how you get. Like, the position that I can relate. Like the position that Pac was. Like, he was at the peak of hip hop, mm. and he was a target. So there's rape charges coming to him. There's all these politicians saying that they want to block him from progressing in in his career. Yeah. And you know, there's all these all these things that come into play. Kendrick is loved as opposed to what Tupac went through. The Kendrick thing, is loved. Different times, though. That's the thing. Maybe no, it, but that's the thing, though. Like, that can make you make certain tunes. That's why I talk about the heart a lot. Like, Kendrick is not making tunes that Pac felt in his heart because he's right in his life. You know what I mean? Like, when that, when you sent me that tune, that tune, the last one I was, I was, I kept on messaging you about. Mm. You know that one that you yeah, sent? Yeah. And you're talking, yeah. and I said that this, there's life in this. Yeah. Like, there's a difference to that and there's a difference to someone that's consciously stabbing at things. Like, exactly. I want to talk about... I, I, I want to talk about... You mean in the sense of, like, I weren't trying to make that song. It kind of... It found expression. It happened. Yeah. It happened. Yeah. It happened. Like a deep, a deep, like... Yeah, it's pull. deep. Like, mm. like, Pac... Pac was in jail when he wrote most of his lyrics for his albums. Like, mm. when you're in jail and there's nothing to do... Same as Biggie as well, but Pac was more because, I mean... He was in jail for a long time and he had to, he had to vent because the, the dude loves to talk a lot. Mm. 